and welcome to Live Technology Smart. that YouTube has introduced this week. So let's jump right in. The very first update is on the swap of the create button and notification icon in the YouTube app. YouTube is changing the position of the create button in the YouTube app to highlight the ability to create on the mobile by placing this button in the middle of the bottom navigation bar. This shifts the subscription button to the right and notification button to the top right hand corner. Now both the buttons are still accessible and will have the exact same functionalities. According to YouTube, this new spot of the create button will make it easier for the creators to create and upload videos on mobile. This update will first roll out to the users in India on Android and soon it will become available in other countries and also to the iOS users. The next update is on YouTube giving. YouTube Giving allows the creator to support the charitable causes they care about. According to the update, now the monetized channels in US, UK and Canada with more than 40,000 subscribers will have access to YouTube Giving. They can add the donate button to their videos and also on their live streams. Channels with access can fundraise only for the US nonprofits. All right, moving on to the next update. YouTube has also added an update to the channel permissions. If you don't know already, channel permissions lets you have multiple people manage your channel without giving them access to your entire Google account. This lets them help with the things like uploading and moderating comments without having full access or control over your entire channel. In the update, YouTube has added more role options in the channel permissions. There is now a new editor limited role and this role lets you invite users to help manage your videos in YouTube studio without giving them access to revenue data. All right, moving on to the next update. This update is actually pretty cool and I have saved it for the last. In YouTube studio analytics, YouTube has added a new card called other videos your audience watched. This card shows you videos from other creators and channels that were watched most by your audience over the past seven days. I think this is a great update because this type of information can give you insight to the popular video topics your audience like to watch. And you may even have potential collaboration opportunities if those channels are similar to yours. All right, this is all for today's video. I hope this video was helpful to you and you learned something new watching it.